Hey guys, it's Horselover1778 here, and this is an update slash barn tour slash questions video. Um, well let's do questions first. I have two questions for you guys. First one, um, I'm going to start doing pasteling, I think, so, but I'm not really sure how. So if you guys know how to do pastels, could you... Make a video and post it as a response to this one, please. And second one, second question. Um, I airbrush, as most of you know, and I'm wondering if there's people out there that airbrush like me, but, like, better, like, ten times better, like PSQ or LSQ, mine aren't even close, so don't ask, but, um... Well, some of mine might be, but I don't know. Um, I'm wondering if any of you know how to do dapple grays. Dapple grays. Like, gray with dapples. With airbrushes. If you know how, could you make a video and post it as a response to this one as well? Because I'd really like to see how. And, yeah. Alright, so I think we can do the barn tour now. The regular main barn says Maplebrook Stable, that we all know. And then I put a flower pot there. This is our feed room. We got a new table. We got two of them. My dad made them. They smell really good because they're made out of cedar wood. And the other one's down there that I'm using as a step stool to, like, get on a horse. We also got two new briars. This is the newest of the two. Her name is Summertime Bliss. She's the 2010 Let's Ride English Set Mare. Anything wrong with her? She has a scratch right there. A little white line. That would be the scratch. It's the only thing wrong with her. And, by the way, guys, if you're considering getting this set, um, be fair warned that the saddle, it's not a buckle like the other one. It's Velcro. But it does fit draft horses like Winter Song. Mine's on Winter Song right now, and it fits really well. I mean, it's even loose. But the bridle does not fit. The bridle is still buckles, though, guys, so. Fair warning. Bridle's the same, but different color, but it still buckles. And the other new horse we got is this guy. He's in the Dem Twist mold, obviously. And he's the um, Picture Perfect Thoroughbred. I really like him and this mold. His name is I'm a Ladies Man, or Ladies Man for short. He's really pretty. He's LSQ. The only thing really wrong with him, I would say, is he has this funky line in his ear, and it's not a rub. It's like, I don't know what it is, but it's not a rub. I've had a, a couple people tell me, that it's just where the paint dripped or something? I don't know. But it doesn't go through to the other side, so... I don't know. It was there when I got him. And he also had a spot where the paint was coming off his hoof. But I put clear fingernail polish on it, and now it doesn't. So, he's still, like, original finish, but it's got a spot with clear fingernail polish on it. Put him down there. Okay, so in this barn, I know I get really off topic, really easy, sorry. We have Bluegrass Bandit, or Isabella Marie. And we have Big Tricks to Cash, or Cashin' in Big. The Kachis, Little Joe Cartwright's Horse, or Cool Joe Connoisseur. And then we have our Western Tack, and Bridles, and... Stuff. Over here we have our English tack room with leg wraps and a 
extra hall tones and stuff. Aid room, like I've already said, like, two times. And then we have Lily Mine, right there, with her foal. And we have Sandy Beaches. Or no, Sandy Shores, that's her name, Sandy Shores. So we have those two. And this is my homemade trailer, guys. Don't laugh. It's not funny. I didn't feel like going and buying a briar one. So I made one. And I think it looks really cool. Like, there's the slot where they can put their heads out. And it's just cardboard. And I made a little buckle thing. So, like, you can open and close it. I'll show you. See, that comes through there, like that, and then it opens and closes. It's kind of a pain in the butt to do, though, so I won't be, like, opening and closing it constantly. But, just show you it does. So, that's my trailer for the time being. In this pasture, we have Sheik, or his name is 007, 007, Hotshot, Hugo, um, Doc Holiday, he is stardom bound. Secret Serenity, uh, Royal Pride, that's Father Winter's stall, that's Father Winter, Wildfire, um, Trident's King, or Tri King Trident, or something like that, Legally Deducted, and a bunch of foals, and a two classics, um, Lucky Man, and Final Destination are in there. That barn I almost had to throw out. That's why it's on stilts, because we got rain, we got really, 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 really bad rain here, and it got in our basement, and like the floor underneath that barn, and the cement over there, got soaked and it soaked the floor of my barn so we had mold in it so my dad fixed it he killed the mold with bleach water and now it's propped up on stilts so it can't get molded anymore but it was like really bad it was like stuck to the floor and it was really gross so yeah so a little cross ties thing I made that's Galaxy Man, and that's Secret Serenity's Bowl, and I think that's about it. Those are my little stable mates over there. I still have the two stable mates in the shop. I haven't had time to finish them, really. I've been so busy, like, because the end of the school year is coming close for me. We only have, like, five weeks left. And so I have to start getting a dress for, like, our 8th grade recognition, um, or our junior prom, basically. So I'm starting to get my dress together and stuff, and so I've just been really busy. And if I sound funny, it's because my allergies are really, really bad right now. And they're driving me freaking crazy. But, yeah. So, if you have the answer to either of those questions that I had at the beginning of the video, or have any questions for me or anything, none of these horses you see are for sale or trade unless you have a really good offer. Um, so, yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye.